Danny, Danny, let me holler at you. Come here, come, come, come. bring it on in. Let, let, let me talk to you for a second. So as I break down every round that I've sketched about, there's nothing slick in the tools in the rusty shed house. You went to Oakland playing, but they gonna leave there giving head counts. I hope King of the Dot didn't even book you a room. I hope them hospitals giving beds out. We have to talk about some things. So, Danny Myers, you are under the pretense that people like you. You think that you've made it. I talked to you the other week about battling Hollow the Don, and I said in that that you should drop some of these other battles around. But no, you wanted to honor the contracts. I'm going to do what I got to do. I'm going to get through it. You battle Big T on Thursday, fly to Miami on Friday and battle some random person. I don't even know who that was. And then going to go fly all the way to Oakland and try to battle pass on Saturday. Did you think that that was, did you think that that was anything conducive to the growth and development of your brand? Did you think that that was going to work? Huh? Huh? I'm going to tell you what happened. So, oh, y'all want to know what happened? I'm going to tell you what happened. Danny got smoked. He got smoked. Choked in the second round, stumbled in Jersey, all through another round, and got beat by pass. 3-0. And I like you. That's the funny thing. You my man. But if I don't call it like I call it, who gonna call it like it needs to be called? You went out there and got embarrassed, demolished. And Hollow the Don was right there, videotaping it, snickering from the crowd. He even dropped a snippet of you looking crazy on the side of the stage like this after you got smoked. I don't know if we've ever seen this before. This is a dead man still existing. Sharon, can you get out the way? I'm trying to get the dead man. I didn't know he was still alive, y'all. I've never seen a ghost hang out after a battle, people. I don't know if my accent is bad, but this is good. <laughs> Probably reading the comments on Twitter. And, mind you, Mind you, it, the, the, the servers of King of the Dot was hacked though. Malware, spy, I don't know what was going on. So you could barely even get into the site. So only a quarter of the people who saw it really gonna see it. But do you think that this is gonna help you out? Huh? You got hollow. Guess what? I'm wearing an LOM right now. Because you're not gonna be hollow. I'm not picking you to be hollow after that last night. There is no way, and you are my man. And you, you did all of this work this year, all of this work, for what? For you to get smoked by Stewie Newton and now to get smoked by Pass? Man, go ahead, put that champion of the year in Rice. You're not winning that, no way. Salute to them and everything that they do over there. But you're not winning that. They shouldn't even, you, you, you taking yourself out of the top 10, you might be number 30, really, honestly. Because what are you doing right now? There's no way. You don't see Ill Will doing this. You don't see Gichi Gotti doing this. You don't see nobody doing this. The only person that can really battle two, three times in a week like that is DNA. Nobody else. Chef Trez is battling week for week, but he's doing it at a smart rate. He's taking people that he can beat. He took Danger Zone. He probably beat him. He took Snake Eyes. He beat him. He took uh, Ill Will. Oh, yeah, Ill Will got him out of here because Ill Will is Ill Will. But... You can't battle no three days in a row. Rock just tried to battle Shotgun Sugar on Thursday and turn around and battle Rex on Saturday. He lost to Sugar. He had a fire first round, he choked in the second and third. That it is what it is. That's the word now, and I, I got reliable sources. This is what this is what it is. But you, what do you think? <sighs> Danny, we fight so hard to big you up, to sing your praises, to get you where you need to go for you to do this. You went to battle pass and you lost, dog. You got smoked. Might as well put your year in rice. Like, it's okay, it's gonna be a cute year now. That's all it's gonna be. Then he had a cute year. He did not have the top year. We can't even, we're not even gonna say that about you. Nobody will say that about you, nobody. You lost to Stewie Newton, no disrespect to him, but who, my name is probably bigger than his. It is what it is, like, I'm not lying, but it is, like, he, he respected, he, he got a good respectable pen, but, you got 3-0 by him, and then you lost to Pass. Like, none of them, no disrespect to Pass. Pass is a West Coast legend, but if you look at, like, realistically, you're not supposed to lose that battle. You're not supposed, and then you're talking about you want Loaded Lux. For what? For what? What do you want Loaded Lux for? For what? What, 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 what? So you could battle somebody two days before him and get smoked? 
You don't deserve no loaded lux. Hell no. No. No, I don't want to see it. And you damn near don't deserve hollow to die no more. Really, you really don't. Honestly, now I see why they made it a charity battle. Now I see why it's not on the pay-per-view. Now I see why. And you my man, you can call me, I can talk about it. But dog, you talking about a week, two weeks from now? You gonna be hollow? Yeah, fucking right. You gonna probably battle twice before you see him. You gonna probably battle twice before you see him. For what? 1500? 2000? What did you get to go to Miami? Huh? Tell me, what you got to go to Miami, huh? You got flued out? What you got to go down there? Hmm? Tell me. Tell me, Danny. What did you get to go to Miami? Huh? You went to Miami the day after you battled Big T? The day after? You disappointed. This is Sunday school. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not steal from yourself. Thou shalt not kill. You're killing your own career right now. Thou shalt not kill. You're killing yourself right now. This is suicide. So you... You went to Oakland to battle pass in his hometown. In his hometown. And you thought that you could do it on one day prep. When I spoke to you last week, you had rounds for Big T. You had a round for pass. Maybe a round. I don't know how much it was. But in my mind, I was a little concerned. And I told you this. Yo, you're taking a lot of battles, man. I told you this. I the same thing I'm telling you as a man is the same thing I'm going to say on cam to the fans. See, that's the one thing that I want you, uh, all the battle rappers, you know what I'm saying? I don't care who it is. This is why I don't really build super relationships. This is why I don't go stand in your corners or nothing like that. I want you to know that I could be as cool as I am with you. But when this happens, I'm going to talk to you the only way I know how to. Doesn't matter who it is. If this was Rock that did this, I'm going to talk to his soul. If this is Saga, I just got a whole 40, 30, 40 minute joint with Saga. I would do the same to him. Don't matter who it is. I don't care who you are. Because the same way you make money in battle rap, I make money in battle rap. Very good money. At Showtime SP, do I, I take care of him, I take care of my family, I take care of my business. It's all off of battle rap. So we all making money out here. There's enough biscuits to feed the projects, B. Now you go find that man, and don't come back until you find that man. The man that battled this, that's the one that we're looking for. Because trust me, all of the battlers that you be calling out, they gonna look at you like a joke. They looking at you like they're not laughing with you. They laughing at you. They're looking at you like a joke. This dude is. That's why they don't. We don't take you serious. We're not taking you serious, Danny. When you're doing stuff like this, no, we are not taking you serious. And you, my man, you gonna call. I'm gonna call. We gonna speak. But I'm gonna tell you the same thing that I told you when we did the phone interview. I said it. Yo, drop some of them shits. I said it. Yo, where, where's the clip? I'll play the clip just so you remember what I said. I told you not to take all of those battles. I did. I said, drop some of those battles. What did you do? You went for two minute rounds versus Hollow. Two thirties. Well, we don't want you to do no damn two thirties anyway. You want to do two thirties versus Hollow, but you're going to go into battle pass. Dog, what are you thinking about, man? Yo, you, you get the biggest, you make the, you're starting to make some of the worst life decisions, for instance. Remember this? Drop them niggas. We want to see you versus Hollow. Nah, he said the same thing, man, but it was like. I said to drop them. And you should have did that. You should have dropped them. You could have battled them anytime. Anytime. You out here playing street ball before the Super Bowl. Before the, you know what I'm saying? You playing street ball before the NBA Finals, dog. I promise you, we really be trying. Saga got it. Let me tell you how Saga got it. Saga had an opportunity to battle Charlie Clips on Volume 5. Saga turned it down. You know why he turned it down? Because Saga had Rum Nitty. Saga got Reaper Rell. Saga got another battle, 
and he didn't want to take Charlie Clips in between those battles. Because why? He said he needs a month, a month to battle Charlie Clips because he doesn't want to put his brand in the dirt. He gets it. Danny, you can't dance to every song at the fucking party. You're dancing to bachata, house music, hip hop. You want that? You you know how they have them clubs that have eight levels, and the top floor be techno, and then the second level be merengue, the third floor, the floor under that be reggae, reggae music, the one under that house. Though so you dancing to every song in the club. You need to sit. You one of the niggas that we be seeing dancing to every song in the club. You need to sit down, have some punch, check your phone, catch your breath, and then come back outside. We don't want to see you like this. We don't want to see this. Put Danny Myers in rice. Put your year in rice. Put your aspirations for winning the belt in rice. It's not going to happen. Anybody with any common sense is not going to vote for you. You did this to yourself, B. You did this to yourself. This is a self-inflicted wound. You don't think whoever that is in Miami would have understood, yo, I got this going on and I got hollow going on right now. I mean, I know you're going to be mad. Y'all going to say a couple tweets and shit, but I give you a deposit back. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Do you think that that would have been too much to say, Danny? I'm, I'm done with this. I'm not recapping you versus past. I'm not. This is the recap. You got smoked. You got annihilated. You went to Oakland, and you got fucking embarrassed. It's, it's shameful what you did to yourself. And you did this to yourself. I'm going to walk away now. I'm very pissed. <laughs>